Hi, my Aquarius. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I am doing your monthly uh, for May 2017 for Aquarius Sun, Moon, and Rising. I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. If you'd like a personal reading, you can email me at jamiezebra23 at gmail.com. Readings are done over the phone or through Skype. It's your choice. Um, readings are $25 for 15 minutes, $50 for 30 minutes, $75 for 50 minutes, five zero minutes. I also have a one question, one answer for $5 via email only. Um, readings are done over the phone or through Skype. I also have... Um, Oh, well, the $5 one question, one answer is via email only. I've got a new feature where I can interpret your tarot cards. You just snap a photo of your cards, and then you send it to me. Ten cards max, please. One uh, deck. I also have um, kits that I can ship out to you for love, money, protection, all sorts of good stuff. Um, I ship out on Mondays, and you get it on Wednesday. Sorry, guys. I was, I was eating before. <laughs> um, <laughs> and then um, what else do I have? Oh, I've got tarot card classes are $75. It's for one hour. I do that through Skype. Okay, so I'm going to start with your Dorian Virtue um, bonus card, your angel card. This is what you got. Aquarius, Sun, Moon, and Rising, the Eight of Earth. Skilled work is rewarded. Learning all there is to know about a topic. Going back to school. I feel like a lot of you, um, you've, uh, you've been working in a certain area of study or you've been, you've been doing a certain something, but maybe you want to branch out a bit, so you're going to need to tweak it. Or there's new knowledge to be uh, to be learned. Like there, there's new information. I feel like uh, maybe the stuff that you know is could possibly be a little bit outdated, or you're starting to see that it's outdated, or that people, you know, you're like, well, no, 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 we do it this way, and then they're like, no, well, I never heard of that. I just finished school like um like a, a week ago, and we do it this way now, like that kind of energy, and you're like, oh crap, you know, damn, that's I'm pretty old school. So yeah, so there's so there's new information that needs to be learned. Also, um, businesses, certain businesses are going out of style or legally they can't be in business anymore. Um, so what you're trying to do is you're trying to figure out ways, creative ways to to be able to stay under the radar. Okay, we got the temperance card in reverse. This is talking about groups and sex or or religious groups or or organizations that are um. There's a group of people and it's they're not on the up and up. They're not good people or there's a situation going on that's coming out. People people are finding out. Because we've got the uh, the Six of Swords in reverse. So it's a public declaration or some, an unwanted proposal. Could be for love or somebody could be talk, telling your business to people. And it's saying here that somebody's, uh, somebody's going to be vigilant and taking someone down. Because they feel like somebody snitched on them or they're feeling like... Um, or they're feeling stressed out because they don't want they don't want to be with somebody anymore. The person's like, "But I love you and I want to be with you." You're like, "But I hate if you you know you tried to slice my throat yesterday, or you know you stole my money, or you ran over my dog, or you you know you yelled at my cat," and you're like, "I can't be with somebody who would do that." Or because of somebody's religion, or because of somebody's um, situation, they don't want to be involved. Maybe somebody's religiously not compatible, or maybe, you know, somebody's a gang member, and they're like, you know what, I, I'm just not into gang members, I'm sorry, you know, that sort of thing. There's just, there's certain things about somebody that they can't really, that's who they are, or they've made choices to be that way, and it's saying that that won't work. There's just too much BS going on. Also, um, some of you may end up having a miscarriage, or you may be having anxiety over a loved one, or somebody may pass away, because you got the, the, uh, the Nine of Swords here. But it's showing here the, that somebody may be, whoa, um, yeah, this is also showing that somebody may be doing something for, maybe doing something negative to somebody for money, because we got these two cards together, that's what that means, like death and then money, so that usually means either somebody's going to be getting money because somebody passed away, or somebody's passing away because they're getting money, that's creepy. And um, some, I feel like some people have already made a public declaration that they, I'm going to go F and kill somebody or I'm going to go F and, you know, take care of this bitch or this, this dude, you know, so hopefully that's not you Aquarius. That's really creepy. I mean, guys, I got to tell you what the cards are saying. Okay. So yeah, if this is you, I'd go to law enforcement. Like if, if you think somebody's up to this, I would go and say something. That's not good. Yeah. Wow. Uh, this, okay, sorry guys. This is kind of creepy. All right. Very, very creepy. Wow. 
Okay. Um, and then for some of you, you're dealing with a fellow air sign, a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius person. This Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius person, they may um, they may or may not want to talk to you. They're, maybe they're laying low or they're, they're being silent. Um, it's saying that they will be back, but right now they're taking a resting period. Um, maybe Aquarius, you, you, may be, you may have done something to this air sign or this air sign may have done something to you and you guys need a break. There's a break that's going to be really needed. Also, this is money. There's money going on. Some somebody's uh somebody's having to pay some money because of a child, or somebody's having to come out of their pocket because of something, and they're not really too happy about that. Um, some of you are dealing with a with a Capricorn or Taurus or a Virgo person that's supposed to be paying you for something, but it's saying that um, the person may not pay you, and that could be an issue. Also, for some of you that were planning on traveling, your travels might be delayed a little bit because we got the Six of Swords in reverse. You may just have to, yeah, it, it just may, due to you a breakup or due to an issue, it's saying here that, that maybe you're not going on a trip because there could have been a breakup or something. Maybe you planned the, planned the trip while you were dating somebody or while you were in a relationship with someone or while you were still friends, but because you're not friends anymore, it's saying no. Also, there's competing interests going on. So make sure that, uh, that you're not going to the same person for help. Like, do, like it's kind of like somebody having the same um, lawyer. You know, okay, I want this one thrown in prison. And then the other one's like, no, I want that one thrown in prison, but you got the same lawyer. So make sure that you're not uh, drinking out of the same cup, if you know what I mean. Make sure that if, if you've got something going on, you're not, yeah, be careful. Be super duper careful. All right, guys, Aquarius, ta-ta for now. Have an amazing May.